This is uh, N. Nagendra Prasad, TGT English from TTW URJC Boys Thirmalaya Palam English Medium School. Day 13 Spoken English. Roll of will in spoken English. Today we are going to learn will, modal auxiliary will. To express near future actions, we use will. For examples, I will finish my work in a few hours. Means, the work is not yet completed, soon it will be completed. The train will leave the station at 10 am. So, the train not yet started. Soon it will start. I will go to head office tomorrow. It's tomorrow's action, not today's action. Note, will is used after all subjects in spoken English. In our previous class, we learned shall is used after I and V. The rest, second person and third person subjects are followed by will. We discussed in future tense also. But in spoken English, will is used in all, after all subjects. Will becomes won't in negative sentences. We have already discussed it in short contrast forms. Mr. George won't come to work tomorrow. George will not come tomorrow. It meaning will not come tomorrow. They won't take risk. Let me see next. Will is equal to be going to. What is this? We usually in spoken English people use instead of will be going to. Here be means be forms. Sometimes we use be going to instead of will in spoken English. Examples. I will watch the film on the TV after she finishes her homework. This is a sentence. Instead of this, we can also say the same sentence. I am going to watch. Here am is be form. V1 going to. I am going to watch the film on the TV after she finishes her work. In these two ways we can express the near future actions. My uncle is living in the USA. He is going to be a uh, next Sunday. Here he is going to express near future actions. Forming negative sentences. Let's know. I didn't study last night and I am not going to take the test. As I didn't study last night, so I don't take. I won't take the exam. Here we can use I won't also. They aren't going to play cricket this evening. We can convey the same sentence. They won't play. Harish is sick. He isn't. He isn't going to be in class tomorrow. How can we express the same sentence in another way? Harish is sick. He won't be in the class tomorrow. Good. Difference between will and be going to. Usually, do you think there is any difference between will and be going to? Sure, there is a slight dis difference. Of course, we use will instead of be going to, be going to instead of will. But there is difference. Let us check. Though will and be going to are used interchangeably, they often express two very different meanings. Let us check. We will find the difference between them 
with time and practice only with practice we can identify the difference between them will and be going to refer to a specific time in the future these two use refer to express a specific time in the future let us check the will will expresses a voluntary action or willingness suppose a person wanted to a work voluntarily without compulsion with his willingness we use will in such situations examples it's too late he said it's too late i won't be allowed in the classroom he expressed his feeling then b replied don't worry i'll drop you at your school on my bike here b shows his willing to drop a at a school voluntarily without any request any compulsion next will use to express promise also if you want to promise somebody else you can use will examples don't worry i will call you as soon as i arrive at the airport it's his promise thank you for lending me the money i'll pay it back on friday i promise see how the promise made here i promise i won't tell him about the surprise birthday party suppose if you want to give a birthday party to your friend you make you keep it as secret so one of your friends promise you he won't tell the secret reveal the secret be going to use to express a future plan be going to use to express a future plan for example miss catherine is going to marry david miss catherine is going to marry david means she is going to marry him we are going to build a new house we do not have any house so we are going to build a new house it's a future plan be going to and will expresses prediction prediction means expect something happened soon to express something will be true or will occur in the future will or be going to should be used i repeat to express something will be true or will occur in the future will or be going to should be used examples be careful you will hurt yourself means it is predicted i think virat will become the champion of this year it's also prediction sometimes we predict why the uh, while the game while the a match is going that virat will become the uh, champion of the year look at those black clouds it's going to rain so whoever may everybody can say if the black clouds appear on the sky in the sky <coughs> might be right she is studying hard she is going to pass the exam so if you see someone reading regularly what do you uh, predict definitely she will pass the weather reports say it will be sunny tomorrow so all these are the examples for predictions by using this two there is a modal conversation between two friends let you listen this modal conversation how are you jaya just fine thank you devi how do you do all is well will you join robert's party day part to the day part tonight i'm sorry i haven't completed the project yet moreover today is the last day to submit it don't worry i'll help you in your project thank you very much 
Will you think our MD is going to join the party? No, I don't think so. He is not going to join as he is busy with board meetings. Okay, let's finish the work first. Sure. Okay, boys. Have you listened the conversation carefully? Okay, good. Likewise, you also do the practice this conversation at your village learning circles and prepare some more conversations using will and be going to and do practice at your VLCs. Thank you. Have a nice day.